crescendo! Welcome to our first lower bracket match here of the Northwest District Championships. And this one still will not be a bore with an absolute scoring clinic in the autonomous period to start us off. Still nearly a tied game. It's basically the mobility bonuses splitting your two alliances. And now blue takes a two point lead, exactly one mobility bonus. We didn't see code purple leave the starting zone there. And that ends up making that lead happen. Drivers now take the controls and there's traffic abound already on both sides of the field. Some of it was friendly between those blue alliance machines and the rest of it a little bit of cross-alliance traffic near the Red Alliance source. Three Red Robots over in their subwoofer and amp area. A lot of amp score coming at you there, especially from Code Purple. They were tagged in here as a backup bot. They will now remain with this alliance through the remainder of their time here in the playoffs. Lots of amplified notes going up into the Red Alliance speaker. They still trail by three as the Blue Alliance does not slow down the cadence. Future Martians send a few notes up towards their speaker and already back to the source. Sonic Squirrels jamming it. There's an amp note, and there comes an absolute flurry of notes. That was the combination of Pack of Parts and Future Martians never taking their foot off the gas. They now trail by two points as the Red Alliance amplifies their speaker. Those are worth five points apiece, but the Red Alliance not really making the maximum use of that speaker. Jack and the Bot manages to get a buzzer beater as that amp bonus expires, but they now go back to trailing by three with a minute left to play, and some long times to line up here on both alliances, actually, as kind of the uh, adrenaline builds up between the two sides. Jack and the Bot lines up towards the end of the Red Alliance amplified speaker. They now take a lead, and it's a little bit more comfortable than their last one, 14 points. Will we have the Red Alliance comeback? to remain in our playoffs. Bumpers shredding away over here on the Jack and the Bot machine. You can see that they use blue and green pool noodles to make those bumpers. Not a detail you normally get to see on the field. And these scores, not common to see on the field either. Both alliances about to cross over into triple digits before adding anything from the end game. Source running out of notes over here on the Red Alliance side of the field. Back and forth, back and forth. Red Alliance now with a more comfortable 14-point lead as they pick up the pace towards the end. They find their stride. 10 points separation on the live score. Most robots still on the ground at the end of endgame. All teams sweating here at the end of the match, and we are two at the booth. We'll be back with scores soon.
Before we can post scores from that last match, the head referee has issued a yellow card against the Red Alliance for violation of rule G418 that is damaging contact to a Blue Alliance robot, and that is again rule G418. And with that said, our scores have been finalized for match number five. That is a Red Alliance victory. Moving along in the lower bracket, 123 to 112. They will stay in, and we'll see them again round three, match number 10. And that is, folks, time to bid a fond farewell to our number four alliance there. So, folks, let's hear it one last time for their alliance captain, 9023. Their first selection, 2930, the Sonic Squirrels. And their second selection, 1294, the Pack of Parts. Playoffs match number six, coming soon.